السلام علیکم مائی نیم از عبد الرحمٰن اینڈ دا ٹاپک ڈیٹ واز اسائنڈ فار اس واز کرٹینزم سو لیٹ اسٹارٹ آور پریزنٹیشن دا ٹیبل آف کانٹینٹ آف آور ٹو ڈیز پریزنٹیشن انکلوڈس انٹروڈکشن آف کرٹینزم سائن اینڈ سمٹمز آف کرٹینزم کوزز ٹائپس ٹی تھری اینڈ ٹی فور رول ان کرٹینزم ٹی تھری اینڈ ٹی فور سینتیسز اینڈ ٹریٹمنٹ Let's discuss the basic introduction of this disease. It is a disease related to thyroid hormone deficiency. Its definition is, cretinism refers to the congenital hypothyroidism or underactivity of thyroid glands during early childhood, leading to stunt growth and mental retardation. Its signs and symptoms include stunt growth and mental retardation, short stature that is also called dwarfism mild neurological impairment with reduced muscle tone and coordination hearing and speech defects unable to maintain posture and balance with characteristic walking style maxedema enlargement of the thyroid gland goiter the sparseness of hair and nails voice will be deep and hoarse retardation of sexual attributes thickened skin enlarged tongue protruded abdomen umbilical hernia delayed tendon reflexes and decreased intelligence as you can see this picture depicts the symptoms of cretinism that includes dry hair and sparse hairs thin lateral eyebrows periorbital edema puffy dull face with dry skin the signs and symptoms of this disease at later stages include retarded learning abilities reduced intelligence breathing difficulties slow pulse rate and crying very little let's discuss the causes of this disease these include lack of thyroid gland and failure of thyroid gland to produce thyroid hormones especially in congenital cretinism or congenital iodine deficiency syndrome and the second cause is iodine deficiency in the diet during pregnancy So let's discuss the role of thyroid gland and its hormone that are T3 and T4 role in cretinism. Iodine is necessary for the formation of thyroid hormones. These hormones play an important role in growth and metabolic regulations in our body. So let's discuss the steps in the formation and release of thyroid hormones. It includes the following steps. In the step 1 there is a synthesis of thyroglobulin in the follicular cells and these cells are released into the follicular lumen in the step 2 there is a transport of iodide ions into the follicular cells by active transport and they move into the follicular lumen by facilitated diffusion this process is called iodine trap this is the most important step in the third step Oxidation of iodides takes place in the borders of follicular cells. In the fourth step, there is an attachment of iodine with tyrosine which which is catalyzed by the enzyme peroxidase and it forms monoiodotyrosine and diiodotyrosine. In the fifth step, there is a linking of iodinated tyrosines together to form T3 and T4. and now let's discuss its release it is include the step 6 in this step 6 endocytosis of thyroglobulin colloid colloid step 7 cleavage of t3 and t4 from thyroglobulin by lysosomal enzymes and release of hormones from the follicular cells into the blood now let's discuss its types It has two main types primary cretinism and secondary cretinism primary cretinisms have two types of causes congenital causes and acquired causes congenital causes include thyroid dysgenesis and acquired causes include autoimmune diseases and iodine deficiency and secondary cretinism includes the genetic causes that includes mutation in TTF gene And now let's discuss the treatment of cretinism. It includes clinical evaluation, diet supplementation and oral levothyroxine. Once diagnosed, 
Treatment should be started within one to two weeks of life. Treatment should be started before the onset of symptoms. If developmental abnormalities and mental retardation start to appear, it will not reverse even with thyroid hormone replacement therapy. The recommended dose is 10 to 15 microgram per kilogram of body weight. The dose should be increased as the age progresses. Everyday treatment with thyroxine should be initiated as early as possible. As mental retardation that has ensured already is only partially reversible. With early treatment, physical development and growth can be revived and mental retardation can be checked. And that's all for the, this disease, cretinism. Thank you so much. Allah Hafiz.